Richie Port crashed out. Gavin Thomas has crashed out. Gerardo's crashed out. Valverde crashed out day one. This is that was the most epic Tour de France stage I've ever seen. How about you? That was that was insane, man. That was I mean, you know, we gotta think of these guys in hospital, you know, they they gotta recover and not for our entertainment. So best wishes to everyone. Gerardo, Valverde, Port, Gavin Thomas, best speedy recovery for you guys. Pro sport, hardest fucking job on the planet, man. Pro sport. Hardest job in the planet is cycling. Pro cycling, nothing comes close. But that was insane. Richie Port just man, that would that would have hurt. You know, Dan Martin sort of looked at him like, "What's going on?" And then Dan Mar Martin's like, "Fuck, man, Richie Port's fucked up." But uh, I'm not sure what Richie was doing, man. Like, did he pass out? Did he? What, that line he took, like, what what happened there? Like, you know, Garen Thomas didn't know what happened there, but the line which he took, did he just? just phase out or did he sneeze or what happened to you know how, how, how did let me know down below how did Richie Port even crash I saw that like why would you take that line that was like it's almost like he passed out or something like that so either way um, unfortunately out of the Tour de France and uh, Garen Thomas out and we don't want to see any of these guys crash out and we don't want to see anyone crash on any bike race but to have the GC containers crash out you know it takes away from the battle for us fans but uh, Cecil V, but that was crazy, man. That's the most crazy stage ever. This is the most crazy Tour de France I can think of, man. Fucking Peter Sagan, Mark Cavendish. You know, I'm gonna go get some sleep. <laughs> Fair trade, organic, 